Hello YouTube and welcome back to my Let's Play Super Mario 64 series. This is episode 3. Now uh, in the last two episodes you saw us get 6 stars. So today I'm going to aim to grab a few more. I'm trying to think of a good one to go for. Alright, I think we're going to go back to the uh, bob land and get another star in there. <coughs> oh, it's the red coin one. Um, Alright, well, even though we're supposed to be getting the red coin one at this point, we're actually not going to right now. Um, we're going to get another star. It's actually kind of easier. And that is the Chain Chomp star. You want to avoid getting hit by Senor Chain Chomp and just kind of... Yeah, you don't want that to happen. Kind of just want to get up here and... Boom. There we go. Ha ha! Gotcha! Yeah, see now uh, Chain Chomp runs over, breaks that, and we have ourselves a star. You see, I'm trying to go for a couple easy ones so I can get us the first Bowser. Um, and I've kind of thought about what I said. I decided I'm not going to really edit <clears throat> too much when I make mistakes because it kind of works. Even when you make a mistake, it's more real. And also, what I figured out too is it gives you a great opportunity for some funny commentary. So I uh, think we're going to let that roll. Okay, um... Chain Chomp. Uh, Thwomp, sorry, Thwomp. <coughs> I apologize for the cough. I have some sort of a cold that will not go away. Alright, so we're gonna go for another star here. Nice, easy. Well, kinda easy. Oh, son of a pouch! You know what, actually we're not going to play around with this world right now, because I don't want to fall, I don't want to die. Ah. <laughs> but no, we're going to really go. Um, as much as I hate this world, I'll go get one in here. I think this is Jolly Roger Bay. Really, Mario? Really? And um, something I actually found out was... There's actually another YouTube user who's also... You know what, actually no, I know what to go for. I know what to go for. I'll come back here in a little bit. I just remembered what I can go for and it's in this room. You see, there's another YouTube user, his name is Dr. Parabola. That's Dr. Parabola. And he's actually doing the same Let's Play I am. He actually started like a day before me. And I had accidentally found him through Twitter when I was trying to find a way to plug my Let's Plays a little bit. And I, at first I thought, okay, this is bad, we're going to be two competing Let's Plays. Until I started watching his Let's Play and I realized something. There's an advantage to um, me and him doing the same Let's Play. And that is that we can actually indirectly help each other if somebody forgets how to do something. Like, I know he doesn't remember how to get the um, flying cap thing. So I'm going to make sure that I definitely show that one off as soon as I beat Bowser. So he can see how to do that. And this is actually going to serve good for both of us because then when I forget a mystery star like this one, it gives me a source where I can go look and say, oh yeah, I remember where that is. Because I used to play this game all the time, but, you know, over time I fell in love with things like the PlayStation, and, well, you know, Nintendo kind of fell out a little bit from me, and I finally have a chance to go back and replay the games I was raised on. Come on, Mario, swim! There we go, we have our eighth star. I think we can go fight Bowser now, if I'm not mistaken. La 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 la, going to get the stars, and there we go. Here we go! <coughs> Again, I apologize for the call.
You've recovered any of the power stars, now you can open the door with the big star, but Bowser is just ahead, can you hear the princess? Alright, well, let's go get Princess Peach. Yeah, like, it's really gonna be that easy. Ha ha ha. Run over to the giant star. Open the door. Almost made it, huh? Bah ha ha, I've stepped right into my trap just so I knew you would. I won you, friend. Watch your step. Okay. So we run here. Yeah, the Bowser world has um, red coins you can collect, too. So we're gonna go here. Ha ha. Avoid the flames. Leap. Screw you. Actually, you know what? There we go. And I'm actually, unlike um, Dr. Parabola, he's actually doing this where he's actually got a second file he's running called a practice file where he's actually practicing the game and planning it out. I'm kind of going more off of what I remember. More so, and not really going through and practicing because I don't really have the patience to play this game a billion times because I've already played it a billion in my life. I've probably played it like two billion, and unfortunately my mom is the one who got me started on Nintendo years ago. She's the one who wanted us to get our first Nintendo 64 and everything, so she's always been a huge Mario fan. Which means, by practice, you know, she's not that great at games. I wouldn't say video games are her strong suit at all. Haha, <laughs> Bowser level in one shot. Got it. And, um, so that's often led to me having to help her a bit. Tough luck, Mario. Princess Toadstool's in here. Gwahaha, -ha. go ahead. Try and grab me by the tail. You'll never be able to swing me around. A wimp like you won't throw me out of here. Never, ha. Huh? Alright, well, let's just see how accurate that is. Oh, wow, you do move fast. There we go. Swing him around. And... Yes! Got him! First shot! Ha ha! Yes! Take that, Goomba! Take that! Take that, Koopa! Ha ha! Grr! I was a bit careless. This is not as I had planned, but still, I have the power of the stars and I still have Peach. Wah ha ha! You'll get no more stars from me. I'm not finished with you yet, but I'll let you play for now. You'll pay for this later. We now have a giant key. Which means we can now access the basement world. Use the power of the key, Mario. So here is the basement of uh, Peach's Castle. It's a nice basement, you know, over here you got Toad standing by a wall. Those flames do hurt, as uh, Dr. Parabola has demonstrated before. I know he was looking for a, um, a magic wall here in the game. I just want to kind of show them where that is. Here's the entrance door. Hang a right. Go forward. Turn here and there. And there's um how you get into shifting sand. I think we're gonna try and um get this one out of the way. Oh shit! So okay, that didn't go as planned. So yeah, you run over here. Don't get caught in the quicksand. Seriously, I mean that. Don't get caught in the quicksand. Watch out for the giant crushing block. Don't 
get crushed by it. Or don't fall in the quicksand like that. Okay, we're not gonna try this one right now. Just for, um, for the sake of our health. I think instead we're going to... Alright, Fire World. There's a nice easy red coin one in here. We're supposed to be doing bob -omb the Bully, but, um... Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, God. Mario, make the jump, make the jump. I love these eye things. You make them spin out and you get a blue coin for it. And magic warp points. Those are always nice. We're just gonna go here. Leap here. Now this easily proves to be one of the most difficult points in the game, if you don't know what you're doing. Or if you're careless like me, but there we go, we have another star. And boom. Alright, now uh, we're gonna end this one for now. We're up to nine stars. Uh, when we come back, we'll tackle the bomb, the bully, and possibly in the talons of the vulture. So until next time, this is Dan signing off. I hope you enjoyed this Let's Play.